Hey folks, Harry here for Hardcore Course Updates and Reviews tonight. I'm going to do a quick review on Brian Clement's film Binge and Purge. I think that's how you say his last name. <laughs> um, I got recommended by one of my members in my uh, Gore group. Um, told me I'd really enjoy this. Uh, Brian did the um, Meat Market series. He's a Canadian film director. So I definitely wanted to check out his work. I like his shit. Um, Binge and Purge is basically about um, a disease that affects um, certain people, I guess. Uh, you, get, you get this infection where you become a cannibal. Almost like a zombie, but not really. Um, it, it, that, that's basically the story where the, there's a group of people that are fighting these cannibals and I guess they're like all over the city um, uh, and they're, they're like uh, wealthy people, these cannibals, and they're knocking off people, eating them and stuff. They actually had one of them had a cooking show. It was kind of funny how to make people. Um, so uh, I thought the story was pretty original. It was really cool. As far as the gore effects go, they were pretty good, top notch. Of what um, what happened? There was one scene where a guy was eating this guy's face or neck, and then uh, what happens was like they eat these people and then they puke, spew this like acid like vomit back up, like, kind of like in the fly. And he pukes all over this guy's face and melts his face, which was kind of a cool scene. Um, but there's a bunch of gut munching in this film, really good gory effects, which um, he usually does a pretty good job with on his films. So. Um, yeah, the only issue I had with the film was it was kind of dark in some scenes, and I noticed that in his other films too. I don't know what his lighting was kind of shitty, um, so but it didn't really affect too much of the gore scenes. Uh, you could see a lot of it; uh, the effects were pretty good. So um, yeah, I recommend this film if you're into uh, his kind of other films, this meat market meat market series. If you like those, and check out Binge and Purge. Uh, it's on Sub Rosa Films. You pick up pick it up for really cheap. Um, I didn't watch this other one on here, it just didn't look like my cup of tea, maybe someday whenever I'm bored on a rainy day, so uh, that's my review on Binge and Purge, check it out, uh, and have a gory one.